today, and today I am unboxing Knives Out. This is my fourth favorite movie of all time. It's directed by Ryan Johnson, the guy who people said he ruined the Star Wars saga with um, Last Jedi, which I really liked, which everybody has different opinions. You can agree with me, but yeah. So this one is a whodunit, which it's a really interesting story because I watched this in January at a theater and me and my mom are the only ones who really want to see it. My sister and my, my dad thought this was going to be scary because it's PG-13. It's called Knives Out to you would think it would maybe be a little scary. And so my dad was like, had my sister ready to run out of the theater if they needed to, but they didn't because this isn't a scary movie. And it's rated PG for part, like language and other stuff, yeah. But um, Knives Out, it, ha it stars... Daniel Craig, the, the um, most recent 007, which his movie just got postponed to like this November 25th due to coronavirus. Chris Evans, Captain America, which, spoiler alert, if you haven't seen Endgame, don't listen to me right now, go watch it before you watch this video. Listen to me, but I hope they bring Captain America back because he is my favorite um, superhero out of all of them. Him and Spider Man are pretty close, but I think he's my favorite. Anna D. Armas, she was never really known for anything else, but um, she was starred in Blade Runner 2049, which me and my dad watched Blade Runner, the original, and we didn't really like it, but I heard the sequel's good, so we're going to um, end up watching it, but she, it says she's actually in the new Daniel Craig movie, so I thought that was pretty funny, because um, Daniel Craig and Anna D. Armas are in two movies together over the course of one year, which is a little funny. Um... Jamie Lee Curtis is um, also in it. She um, played, I haven't seen many movies by her before. I've seen Freaky Friday, which was probably the funniest. And she's also in, um, she's like Laurie or something from, I've never seen it. I've just seen like what her name is from um, Halloween and a lot of other fa really famous actors. And Christopher Plummer plays the old guy who ends up getting murdered and they have to find out who the who killed him and um he's actually the guy if you don't i don't think i've said it before but i'm a huge pixar fan and i've seen up and he's the main um villain and so um i know a little bit about him because i re researched him but the slip cover is pretty nice it has it actually doesn't have the poster art like this is so different from the poster art which i like this better than the poster art and the back has the Rotten Tomatoes sticker, which got nominated for three Golden Globes and one Academy Award, which it should have won them all because this was top number one, number one in 2019, and this is my fourth favorite movie of all time. But it says, it, you can read what people said there, and then I'll let you guys pause that to read what the movie is about. Okay, and so it says, it says the special features, that's the want to read the special features and it says it includes digital download so or if you have like it's Lionsgate so it doesn't com isn't compatible with movies anywhere which um I have an Xfinity and if you have movies anywhere you can stream it from um like so um like you can hook it up to that so I do but this is like one of my favorite movies and Terminator 2 also it's a Lionsgate one but like I think they should mash together so I can we can watch it on our TVs. But that's not the point. So guys, I will take the slip cover off. It's the same in the front. We got the Blu-ray. Sorry, I do not have the 4K version. Um, my mom got mixed up, which and she couldn't find it because this was like a sellout at where we bought it, and so she found a copy of it. And then same back, but it has the cast this time. If you want to pause and read all the cast and stuff. And if we get into the inside, we gotta take the digital code out. You know, that, I've already doomed it, but I don't want to show any of you guys wasting my time. So I'll show this funny thing if anybody wants to like get it. So this is it's advertising stuff from the movie. So it says get a clue, and it says check out merchandise at the not knives out shop. You would have to see the movie before to understand like the my house, my rules, my coffee kind of thing, and the t-shirt, which is pretty funny. Um, 
So if you want to go to that website and get any of their merch. So guys, this comes with two discs, the Blu-ray and DVD disc. Um, this is the DVD disc. It has like a, I think a magnifying glass on it. I'm not sure because it's pointy at the end. I've never seen a magnifying glass that's pointy at the end, but that's not the point. Um, and then this is the knife that Colin Fondy, the Christopher Plummer, it just is involved with his death. That's all I'll say. And I never realized this until now. It's a little more job. And then this is the Blu-ray disc, the one that says the dagger. So guys, that is my um, unboxing for Knives Out. It's a phenomenal movie. I will be doing a review soon on it. And I'll see you guys in another video. Goodbye.